Okay, this will be a black and white piece. Sorry about the shaking camera hand again. It's going to keep shaking. I've got a lot of videos to make and I have to somehow somehow deal with this shaking. I can't do anything about it, folks. So I'm wondering if we're going to make it that. I wonder how big we're going to make it, going at 400. I actually, let's just close that. I've got to go to black. Let's see what we have. We have here a piece of my own um, copy art, a, a piece of hair on the glass, although this is not the original piece. It's a copy of a copy. So it's a multi-generational, I don't know how many generations of copying that I've done to this. So I'm actually thinking we're going to put it there. But yeah, it's an interesting uh, piece. Um, piece of my own work not using any commercial type of shit that I normally use in my today's demos so I'm just going to put that on the glass like so see how we go Ah, oh, that looks shit ass. We don't have much of it on the glass there. Unless we can make this a nice little minimalist piece, perhaps. Perhaps we could. We could make it into a... That's going to be the centre of the job. So let's see how that looks as we print it out. I don't normally like minimalism. Uh, but let's see if this looks any good. That's this piece. I was expecting a huge amount of the hair being in the middle there, but I didn't get what I was expecting. So let's just line those up. I'm just going to use this because I might end up having the image cropped unexpectedly in mirror image mode. Okay, out it comes. These are our two mirrored versions of this relatively... It's probably not totally minimalism, but compared with what the original is, it looks a bit minimalist. But I, I think I'm wrong. I don't think it's quite minimalist enough to be minimalism. I'm not a scholar on art, by the way. I just make art, folks, I don't study it. Yeah, that looks really quite nice. It looks a bit minimalist, but it looks nice. I think now we can call this demo quits.